What, uh, what does a defenseman like Eric bring to the lineup, a former teammate of yours, and uh, how, how can he help this club at 35 years of age? Well, he brings uh, some great experience and uh, some size and um, good hockey sense. You know, he'll bring he'll bring that leadership development to the back end as well. So uh, uh, he's a welcome addition. Is it a fine line in managing minutes, 15, 16 minutes of game, when you get to 15, 16 years in the National Hockey League? Well, we'll, we'll see how he does. I think it, that that all remains to be seen. We. Uh, you know, we play the. I play the, the defenseman according to uh, how I feel they're playing on on any given night. So. Um when I look at the sheet at the end of the, the game is, uh, is is when I really you know you understand on how much they play. But you want to put them. We have a plan going into the games on what situations that each and every one of our defensemen will play. So uh, we'll get we'll get Eric into the mix uh, uh, tomorrow night and and, uh, and let him do his thing. Tim Erickson last night just the, the play to draw the too many men on the ice. Uh, you guys yelling from the bench to provide him a perspective. I think some of the guys were, but he's he's got great hockey sense, you know, and good puck ability. You can tell that uh, he can calm the calm the play down when he uh, and he's and he's in good position uh, more often than not. And there's some things system-wise that he needs to get uh, a hold of, like all of our new players. So we worked on that. We discussed that today. We showed them video on it uh, before the game. But uh, uh, sometimes that takes more than a, a couple of days to sink in. But I thought he played uh, a very strong game for us. Just back to Eric for a moment. The guy's won three World Championships, an Olympic championship. What what does that mean to a room, uh, at least in the final 18 games? Uh, I think it means a lot. You know, I think when you bring in experience like that, he wants to do well. Um, he's not coming in and uh, has any intention of riding out his career. He wants to continue to play. Uh, so I think he has a lot to prove. And uh, you know, when you bring that type of experience, I think that's helpful uh, later in, on in your career. You know, uh, uh, everything else starts to slow down, but the, but the mind doesn't. And uh, those experiences, are something that he can draw on, and uh, also help with uh, with some of our younger players, our younger defensemen in particular. So. Uh, He's a welcome addition. Why do you think uh, Tim hasn't found the home? He's a young guy, four, four or five teams already. I knew uh, uh, just a little bit about him before uh, he got here, and so I watched some film with him. I think, uh, you know, he, he has a lot of ability to. Uh, to find a home and play in the National Hockey League, I think there's some fine-tuning to his game uh, that he needs. Um, you know, he's, he's a, again, he's got good hockey sense, he's an intelligent hockey player, and that's a great thing to build off of. So uh, we'll continue to work with him and uh, and uh, watch him develop. I have some things that I've talked to him about already, and uh, hopefully we can grow grow his game. He can grow it in a, in a, in this environment here with us. Do you think he has a, a chance to be an important piece the next couple of years? Uh, I think, yeah, I think all of them do. You know, I think it's a great opportunity, and he understands that. Um, you know, we'll uh, we'll use him in in all situations, and he'll get some uh, some time to uh, to prove to us that uh, he's an everyday NHLer and uh, brings an element to our our team that uh, something that we can covet. So, um, you know, that that. That's what we're working on. That's uh, the opportunity that he has in front of him, though. We won't ask you to comment on what happened with Joffrey and TSN yesterday. Can you speak about Joffrey's ability to shut out distractions like that and get on with the game? Anytime you're in this league for a long time, you have to have that, that ability. Uh, you know, we find uh, a safe place for us as hockey players and as coaches and management in the arena and amongst our teammates. and. Uh, you know, Joffrey's, you know, I'm sure dealt with things like this in the past, but uh, uh, as a team, we need to stick together and, and support him. But uh, it comes with experience. You know, you go through uh, trade deadlines, you go through uh, media scrutiny, you go through good times and bad times. And uh, uh, some days it's a mental challenge, but you rely on your teammates and uh, as a support system. Would you say the last 48 hours has been a test of the whole team in that regard then? No doubt. Uh, it's been a test of uh, your character and uh, who you are. And uh, you know you can get exposed in, in situations like this, but uh, you, you know the the longer you're around the game, um, and you have to show your show your character and, and uh, be able to deal with difficult situations.